Hey everybody! Welcome to another video where I do whatever I want and today I want to give Wikifeet more content. Someone gave me this idea on a live stream where I said I wanted to do more long-term product testing like a week-long process or like a month-long process and so someone said try the foot peels and I went what? On Amazon there are a bunch of different foot masks and apparently you keep them on for about an hour and then like the next day you soak your feet in some water and then a week later all of the rough nasty skin on your feet just peels away. I've got some nasty soles in my feet. Like, I use my feet. I'm not nice to them. So I was like, okay, well, if anyone in the world needs this, it's me. So I bought two different kinds. Like, obviously, you know I'm gonna use one on one foot and one on the other because there's two products and I have two feet. That is just like a given. So I'm gonna put the masks on today. I'm gonna soak them tomorrow and then I'll vlog the process of the skin being just falling off my feet. Like, I'm not quite sure what happens. I don't know if my feet just, like, dissolve. I mean, obviously, my feet don't dissolve. Right? Let's begin. By the way, whoever runs Wikifeet and puts my pictures on Wikifeet, while I have this weird sense of pride that I'm highly rated on Wikifeet, I do not consent to being on that website, even though I don't have to consent, like, because um, it's just a thing, which is gross. I feel weird about it. Stop finishing over my feet. They're not even that good. But anyway, ha, huh. socks are still on. You don't have me yet, wiki feet. So let's do the, do I have to wash my feet? Ugh, wash my feet, gross. I'll be right back. Oh, they are fresh and they are clean. So we're gonna put this one on my left foot. Oh, it smells good. Why are there open stickers? Why did it come with two open stickers? Oh goodness, there are so many steps. I should have read this before I started. I need a clean pair of socks to put on over the mask. Once I put it on my feet. Be right back. Got it. Okay, so, oh. Like a little butterfly. Okay, it smells really good. So this one's going on my left foot. Oh, okay. It's on there. Peel off the red double-sided film and seal the opening. There is no red double-sided film. Does anybody see red double-sided film? Cause I'm not seeing any. What are they talking about? Nothing in the package. Nothing else in this package. What do they want? I'll just, I'll use a sticker. There, I used an open sticker. Oh, I kicked another video product. All right, now I put a sock over it. Oh yeah, oh yes. Oh, you know what? I didn't do a before picture. Well, we'll do it on my right foot. Here you go, wiki feet. So this is just like my normal foot looking thing. All right, it's crusty, it's yellow, it's not the prettiest up close. I mean, they've been worse in their life, but it's been winter, so I've been wearing socks 24 seven, but they're dried out, they're pretty nasty. This is a foot like that, that section right there. Yeah, that's hard. That's just hard as a rock right there. It all is. I mean, my, all of my foot is just hard and gross. So now this stays on for about 60 to 90 minutes, and then I'll remove it and rinse it, and then wiping it with a dry towel. Apply foot lotion to keep the feet moist and smooth. Do they think I have foot lotion just mine? Who has foot lotion? I don't have foot lotion. Then a beauty is on the left foot. On the right foot, we will have soft touch foot peel mask. Beautiful feet in just one to two weeks. Two weeks, wait, this was supposed to be a one week process. Clean and dry feet, did it. Put your foot into the mask and seal the opening by the red sticker. This one is supposed to have a red sticker too? I have to soak my feet daily in water for 10 minutes? It's called a shower. Are people just not showering these days? This is a red sticker, but they're not where they're supposed to, it's supposed to be attached to this. Seal the opening by the red sticker. The red stickers are just floating around. This is gross. This is all like mushy and stuff. Okay. Well, strike one for this product. The outside, there's like gunk on it already. Oh, these, this is a giant foot. This is like shack size. What? All right, well, which one is less gross? These were highly rated on Amazon, by the way. I like, I did some extensive 20 minute research, guys. And I found these to be the best ones. Put your feet in the mask and seal the opening by the red sticker. Do they mean with the red sticker? Oh, it's dripping. Oh, it just dripped everywhere. Oh, snap, okay. I like lifted my foot and it all fell out. What is, ha oh, by the way, I'm wearing sliders. <laughs> what? Uh, so far, soft touch is not the winner. Oh, my hands feel really gross. In 60 minutes, we will take these off. So at midnight, that was good planning on my part. Midnight, we'll take these off and uh, wait a week. All right, it's midnight. So uh, let's go to the bathroom and rinse my feet off, pat them dry, lotion one of them, but not the other. And then just document the next week. It is very moist. I have to say, the smell overwhelming after a while. Like, just too much smell. Oh, it's wet. Oh, God. Oh, all right. All right, 
right they're uh, rinsed this one I put soap on this one I did not now I'm gonna lotion the one that was not soap go with the directions guys just go with the directions it's not foot lotion it's just like a vino stress relief lotion so right now I wash them the lotion and uh, they feel sensitive but that is because I think they were soaking in something for an hour and a half so uh I'll uh, let you know what's going on like every other day and then yeah we'll see my skin fall off that's good tubes right that's good tubes ew guys look at my feet oh so nasty oh my god it's just this foot so I guess look at my foot not look at my feet look at this I'm not supposed to pick at it oh but how could I not look how nasty that is just my skin on the ground this is my other foot and it's dry but it's nothing's peeling yet it's Saturday night and I didn't even realize this was happening because I was wearing socks all day and I took off my socks and I was like laying on the bed and Matt was like hey can you not put your feet on the bed that's gross and I realized I was just flaking my feet flakes were all over the bed it was so nasty it's been what Wednesday Thursday Friday Saturday it's like three days and my left foot is peeling my right foot I can see it's on the verge of it's getting like super dry I've been soaking them in the shower basically I take two showers a day that's enough to soak them all right but I'll let you know how this goes it's really hard not to take off my sock and just pick at my foot but that's one thing they said not to do so I won't do it it's Sunday Look at this foot, do you see? I took off my sock and skin just flies everywhere. Look at this, focus on this disgustingness, would you? It's gross, like, oh my God, look at my toes. Like, I don't know how to function. You have to wear socks. There's no way you can go barefoot like this. Look, just all of the skin on my floor. And the other foot, it's like rougher than it used to be, but it's not flaking like this. It says not to pick at it, but oh my God, how can you not pick at this? So many people have unsubscribed to me right now. Just automatically unsubscribed. I would too, I understand. I just put on my sneakers because I'm about to go play basketball. They're not my basketball shoes. I wear sneakers and then I change my basketball shoes. Don't judge it. Anyway, I put on my sneakers and I can feel chunks of skin trying, to, like rough chunks of skin trying to rub off as I walk. And it is not fun. Uh, the left foot is like, it's thinly flaking off and the right foot just started to do huge chunks. I'll show you later tonight after my game, but I wanted to just remind myself that this feeling isn't fun. It feels like my foot is sandpaper and just chunks are wanting to come out. Okay, so I did a whole basketball game and I could feel chunks of my skin just not in the right spots. So we're gonna take off the sock and see what's happening to my right foot. I'm like slightly scared to look at it, but oh, just that's happening. That is a sh that is deep. That's what's bugging me the entire game. <gasps> oh no, oh my God. <laughs> I don't want to look at it. That does not look right. Holy crap. Like, I can't, if I put my, I just, it is so noticeable when I put my foot down. Okay, let's look at the other one. I'm just gonna show you the other one. The other one has been slightly peeling for a few days. No huge chunks. This is what, day six? This, and the top of this is peeling. I have a weird toenail, let it be. The left foot has just been doing a slight peel. Like, just thin little layers. My foot currently, while dirty, sorry, it feels smoother. It feels nice. The chunks have not been noticeable. And there's my right foot. Hold, oh. I'm just holding a chunk of my foot. This is a lot grosser than I thought it would be. I honestly didn't even think it would work. So the fact that my foot, I, I don't want to take off the, th the toe, the toe, the big toe. The, I'm, I'm fl flabbergasted. Oh my God. I have to take it off because I can't walk with it. Dear God. Okay. Oh. <gasps> Oh my God, what am I supposed to do with this? It is so thick. God, my foot is destroyed. Oh, hi dog. <laughs> it's 10 p.m., he's late for his appointment. I'm gonna put my foot to the ground now. My big toe to the ground since taking off that chunk. Oh, it, it hurts, it feels raw. I hate this foot peel. This one is sucks. Like, it is so inconvenient and feels gross. The left one is annoying because it's like, const it's been constantly flaky, like little flakes, but that's it. Look at my foot. Just look at the chunks. It goes all the way to the bottom of my foot. Look at how raw that is. Look at that. I don't know what to do. I'm gonna take a shower and then just keep socks on it. Ah, <sighs> I'm sorry people watching this. Okay, listen, it is two weeks. Not since like I gave vlog, but since I put the bag on my feet, it's two weeks. And the left one is done and doesn't look Look that amazing. The right one just won't stop. You can tell it's almost done. So I will show them to you. So this is the foot. It looks like a normal foot. I got dirt on it. Hold on. You know, sometimes you step on things. It looks softer. Okay, so up here is actually a lot softer than it was. The heel though is still crusty. Look at the heel. It is still a 
crust master. And this stopped peeling about three, four days ago. Anyway, so that's the left foot. The left foot started peeling first and it was flaky. The whole time it was just like thin, thin, sunburned layers of skin coming off. It was never bothersome and it stopped quicker. It started quicker and stopped quicker, but it didn't get a lot of the skin off. It was very surface level and I have some messed up feet. It made the balls of my feet very soft. It did a lot except for the heel. It did nothing for the heel. The right foot still going, but it's been two weeks and this were only supposed to be a one week process. So I'm like, I gave you two weeks, you're done. So this is the right foot. Now this easily comes off. This, it's starting to get to the flaky flake part. It was doing chunks as I, as I filmed before. I will say this one, I think got to the root of the problem a little bit more. It took a long time for it to get going, but once it went, oh, it, it went, it, it went. So here's the top. You can see it's still kind of healing a little bit on the big toe. I could just rub it out if I really, really wanted it to. I could just pick all this off at the end of the day. My favorite thing that this one did that the other didn't was it got the chunks of dead skin right where the toenail ends. So right here, it got huge chunks of skin off and I didn't realize how bad I needed that. Again, I need to cut my toenails, but that's okay. This one got chunks of skin where I was like, oh yeah, that had built up there. Gross. And I can just tell this one, it got chunks of my heel off. Again, it's still going up here. I don't know how long this is gonna last for, but this, this video was planned to go up today. I couldn't wait any longer. It's just little tiny flakes now. This was a big, that's so gross. So that's that foot. It's still working its magic, but I have to say the right foot one, which was soft touch, I believe. I think it worked a lot better than whatever this one is called, Vena Beauty. It seemed sketchier and it seemed grosser, but I think it dug deeper. I will say if you guys are planning to do these, you cannot wear sandals. You have to wear socks and shoes. Clearly, I mean, depending on which one you use, it takes at least two weeks and then more. I don't know when this one was supposed to stop. It was supposed to stop after week one and then it just kind of kept going. So don't do this three days before some vacation where you're like, oh, I gotta show my feet. My feet are crusty. Let me do this. No. Give yourself like three weeks in advance. Do this three weeks before you need to do anything else. Like, hibernate your feet for three weeks and then you're fine. But that's it for today. So out of these two, this one, if you want just a light little layer, just flakes off. Kind of gross, but it's, it's nothing big. Just a light layer. This if you want a deep. Girl, if you want a deep in there. Oh, for hard and thick calluses, please use the second foot mask two weeks after your feet have finished peeling. So I'm supposed to do this one again if I think it didn't get the thickness done. I ain't doing this again. No, I've had my feet falling off my body for the last two weeks. I'm not doing it again. They work to an extent. And if you want it to go past that extent, you do it again. So my feet have been annoying. I have to keep my socks on. Playing basketball, I feel my feet falling off. Sometimes I felt like there were things between my toes, just chunks of skin. It was gross. But if you have some nasty feet and you're like, in a month I need to go show my feet off, I suggest the soft touch. I didn't think I would like it. This one didn't seem right. It just didn't seem right. The plastic bag and the juice just falling and the stickers were gross. See, it says beautiful feet in just one to two weeks. It's been two weeks. All right, but that's it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and my feet journey. If there are any other products you'd like to try, I'm currently testing stretch mark faders slash removers slash reducers. So that video will go up in a couple weeks. I'm down to test, try anything. I don't care what it is. Let me know in the comments below, on Twitter, whatever you want. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. I lost chunks of my body for this. I think I deserve a thumbs up. Remember me and my mom have a podcast out, all things internet. It's on iTunes, Google Play, Spotify, or just go check out my website. There's places to listen to it. Oh wait, I forgot the shout out. We'll go, Emma, thank you for retweeting my testing products video. Just another, just, I'm testing so many products. I love you guys so much. And remember, above all else, stay awesome possums.